All right, everyone, welcome back to Omori. Uh, in the last episode, we fought against the space boyfriend and helped him calm down. Uh, but unfortunately, we couldn't get any leads on our friend Basil. Uh, so, uh, I don't know. I kind of don't know where we go from here, if I'm being honest. Uh, I tried asking Mari for help, and all she said was uh, if I have any type of lead, uh, which I don't. So, uh, let me check the headspace map. Uh, we're in Otherworld right now. Maybe we should try going back to the vast forest or to white space? Um, I don't know. I, uh, oh, maybe that area that was over here opened up. Uh, wow, hi. Uh, <laughs> um, all right, I guess we'll follow him. Oh, it's snowing. Wait, where did our friends go? There's nothing here. Um, okay. Tentacles poking on the ground. Uh, I'm gonna, all right, before I follow you, I'm gonna look around first. Watermelons are my favorite part of summer. Oh, I'll follow you in a sec. Just give me a moment. A wish? But what should I wish for? I have everything I could want right here. You got a donut. Are you going on ahead? Don't worry about us. We'll catch up in a minute. Where did all of our friends go? Oh, there he is up there. To the left, huh? Okay. I'll catch up with you in a sec. Are those cookies? Mari's cookies. Mari's cookies have much more love bacon to them. I could eat them forever. We're still young. We should dream big, right? here oh a ladder um, well I'll climb that in a second but this year you get just one present from all of us <gasps> is that a violin there's nothing here all right well let's hold on let's keep following him I guess uh, well, I assume there's nothing here. Yeah. Where are you trying to take a- where are you trying to take me to, dude? Down there? Alright. I'll go wherever you go. Uh. Okay. What's up? What do you want to show me? boy <clears throat> all right let's see what awaits us can I run okay cool okay
the F key. Sheet music on a music stand. All the notes have been scribbled out. Uh, okay, hold on, I'm a little nervous. Let me take some. Just need a sip of water. A happy family. There's the... Uh, what? The light bulb was up there. Oh boy, here we go again. Anything new in the sketchbook? Tissue box wiping your sorrows away. What? It's different. It's like radiating now. F. <sighs> Alright, well, if we're back in here with, uh, with no door, I guess that only leaves one thing for us to do. Mm hmm? Where's the little, um, oh. alright, I guess we gotta stab ourselves again and wake up. At that time, I saw everything. When you stood here before. Did you see it too? Something behind you. Three days left. Uh, it's morning. Oh boy. <clears throat> you have a new message. Hey, Sonny, it's Mommy. How are you doing? Are you eating well? I was hoping that I could make it back to see you today, but it's the last day of a big furniture sale, and I just can't resist a good bargain. You can take care of yourself for a few days, right? After all, you're a big boy now. Remember to finish your chores before I get back. I left the list on the table next to your door. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Bzz. Wow, you... You're some mom. You want to play blackjack? Uh, sure. How much do you want to bet? I'll bet 25. Dude, that's perfect! A blackjack right out the gate. Uh. Eight and six. That's 14. I'll take a hit. And we bust. Three and two hit me. Nah, you. That mean if he didn't bust, that means he has more than us. Alright, I'm gonna stay. Oh, we both had 20. Yeah, I have 15. I'll stay. Oh, seriously? Uh, I'm gonna stay. 
You're hitting? Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, let's just fucking go ahead and bet 100. So this is uh, 18. I'm staying. What? Damn it. Alright, well. You really got a fucking 20 right out the gate. <sighs> Alright, mom's to-do list. You don't feel like doing your chores right now. Oh, shit. Alright, well. It's daytime now, so. Uh, what's up? Hello, hello, Sunny, are you there? Do you remember me? It's your old friend, Kel. So I, uh, I noticed the for sale sign from your house, and I er, heard from my mom that you were moving away soon. I was wondering if you wanted to hang out one more time before you go or whatever, for old time's sake, you know? What would you like to do? Open the door, do nothing? Um, if it's... We we ignored the door last time, so I'll open it this time. Plus, it's morning, so... It wouldn't throw anything scared us in the morning, right? Hey, what's up, dude? Whoa, you actually came out! Er, uh, I mean, well, I'm gonna be honest with you, Sunny. I really didn't expect you to come out today, so I didn't really have a game plan here. Hey, I know, let's go to Hobbies. It's the Hobby Shop in the Faraway Plaza. You remember the way, right? We used to go there all the time when we were kids. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go! Oh, alright. Empty picnic basket we'd like to save. Yeah. Three days left. Hobbies? I don't seem to have a map of that. First of all, sold sticker on it. Your house has been sold. In three days, you'll be moving somewhere else. Classy white mailbox. Alright, mom mentioned something about looking both... You shouldn't walk in the streets, honey. That's dangerous. <clears throat> Kel's basketball hoop. Seems a little dangerous to be out on the street like that. Wait, hold up, Sonny! I know it's been a while since you've been over my place, but now might not be a good time, huh? Oh, alright. Whose house is this? Empty birdhouse full of sticks and dust. There's no response. It's all this. A statue of a religious figure. You feel as if it is judging you. There's no response. Maybe those are Aubrey and Hero's houses? Okay, no cars coming by. Hey, what's up, dude? Who are you? Preacher, I'm on the way to church, it's, but it's a ritual of mine to take a quick stroll before delivering my sermons. I've had a horrible stage fright ever since I was a child, but a scenic walk always calms my nerves. Pretty boy, life's been kind of stressful lately, but people watching out here helps me put things into perspective. I might make it a habit to come to this park more often. I guess sometimes all it takes to relax is to stop and smell the roses. An artist is diligently sketching away. Oh, that's a cool drawing of the park you have there. Ah! Uh, oh, hi there. Thank you. I'm just practicing. That's what you call practicing, but looks so real. I bet you could even sell that for money. Do you think so, Sonny? Yeah. What? Hype up your artist friends. Sonny agrees with me. Heck, I'd buy that from you right now. Hey, Sonny, can you lend me 20 bucks? Ha, uh, thanks. That's so nice of you, but it's not for sale. It's for my portfolio. I'm trying to get to art school next year. Oh, darn, it's so bad. That would have looked great on my bedroom wall. You really think so? My name's Mincy, what's yours? I'm Kel and this is Sunny. Hi Kel and Sunny. It's nice to meet both of you. Nice to meet you too, Mincy. Sigh. What's wrong? 
Oh, it's nothing. You're the first person to say something positive about my drawing. Sometimes when I'm feeling down, it makes me question myself, and it gets hard to move my pencil. No way. I, I don't believe that at all. I really think your drawing is great. I wouldn't be able to do that in a million years. Don't be so hard on yourself, Mincy. Me and Sunny believe in you. Uh, y yeah, you're right. I gotta shake off those bad feelings. I'll I'll try to buckle down and finish this now. That's the spirit. See you around, Mincy. You got this. What are... There's still these? Oh. Figments of... Can I tag him? No, I can't. Kel's Pet Rock. Okay, this is, um, uh... Hmm. Interesting. A teddy bear. These, like, little... These guys from the park in our dream. Is that a cat? Jungle gym smells like rusty metal. Large metal cat, you remember it being a lot bigger. Oh, dude, the scent of this man is indescribable. What you making that face for, Bub? Is there something on my face? Hey, what's up, dude? Taking some laps. Huh. Oh, hey, what's up? What are you doing here, Cal? You from around this part of town? Oh, well, I didn't expect to see you here, Jay. Sonny, this is Jay's captain of the football team at my high school. Oh, we're in high school? <laughs> Wait, so we're like... Oh, so we're not like kids. We're like... How old are we? I thought that like Omori was like younger than 10 or something. I didn't know you played basketball too. I'm just here to kill time. It's more of a hobby than anything. I'm trying out for a basketball team this year. You're trying out for a basketball team this year, right, Kel? Maybe you can teach me some of your tricks. Yeah, definitely. It sounds like fun. Maybe another time. My childhood friend Sunny here is leaving town in the next few days, so we're hanging out all day today. I'll definitely catch up with you later, though. Sure, we can set something up next week. Same time, same place? Yep, sounds good. See you then. This is, uh... We are a psychotist. Followers of the Holy Bin. As all have littered, all must accept that they are trash. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. Anyone else around here? Huh, huh, huh. Drink apple juice. Have you ever heard the phrase an apple day keeps the doctor away? The same concept applies to apple juice. Apple juice supports hydration. It contains beneficial plant compounds that may support heart health and may also protect your brain as you age. There are no downsides to it as far as I'm concerned. You got trash. What, why would I use this for? Smellian gross. Maybe I can give it to the cultist or whatever. Hey, you guys want some trash? Oh, all right. Maybe it's just cleaning up or something. There's some construction going on here. Sorry, some things just never change. So we're in high school, or at least Kel is in high school. Huh. That's interesting. Oh, there's a tether ball. It smells like rusty metal. Hey, dude, do you want this trash? No? Okay. Hello, youngins. I don't know if you've been watching where you're stepping, but there's quite a bit of trash on this time. If you have to find it, you can bring it to me so I can dispose of it properly. Come on, youngins. Let's help the world one step at a time. Oh, well. Yeah, here you go. I have some. Oh, young guns. So I don't even watch. All right, cool. So I guess we can use that to to get money. Got thirty two dollars. Olive beanie. When I was younger, my family used to go to this park a lot. I remember there there being a lake with a statue in the middle. I can't find it anywhere. What's up, old dude? <coughs> yeah. Ah, today is such a beautiful day, don't you think? I may not have any money, but at least sunlight is free. Huh. You see, this complicates things, because I didn't know that uh, we were, like, 
of high school age. I thought Sonny was like a kid. Or well, high school age is still a kid, but I thought he was like like seven or eight years old, like you know, like elementary school uh, age or something. Yeah, space boyfriend? I just made a wish that I would meet my true love today. Is Sonny like... Huh. Oh well. Some more trash. Come on, Sonny, let's go to hobbies first. Okay. Oh, I can't even talk to this guy? Alright. Huh. Well, here we are at Hobbies. It's probably been a while since you were here, but it hasn't really changed all that much. It's all the same old stuff. Captain Space Boy games, sweetheart movies, a few pet rocks, except now they're vintage. Actually, since we're here, I should probably buy a gift for Hero. He's in college right now, but he should- WAIT! So, Cal is in high school and Hero's in college? I knew that Hero was like way taller than everyone, but I didn't know that meant that he was older than everyone. Jesus. Okay, damn. He's starting to be a doctor, so maybe I should buy him some medicine. Yo! He's gonna be a doctor? I don't wanna be a doctor! Hey! Well, that makes sense considering that he's like, sort of like the cleric of the party. He's like the one who specializes in healing and all that. No, that's a horrible idea. You should pick out the gifts, honey. Let's go around and see what there is. Dude, what? Wait! So... He's in college, dude? So is Aubrey in college too, or is she in high school? People come all the way from the city to shop here. My favorite novel just got a comic adaptation, but the main character looks nothing like how I imagined him. A cardboard cutup of Captain Space Boy. A poster for a new game where you can run around and fight evil monsters on skateboards. An interesting poster. Wow, the monster in the poster looks so realistic. I hope that fighting that would be a tough battle. Will you challenge the monster to a battle? Oh, uh, sure. Dude, what is... <laughs> Why the... Calm down or guard? Oh, we don't have our knife on. Okay. Jackson, I guess that's supposed to be like Jason or something. Is this in, like, going on in her... Sunny was victorious. Hello? Sunny? Earth to Sunny? Uh, whoa, a CD fell from behind the poster. Weird. I wonder who hit it there. I guess we can just take it? You got a Mary CD. Huh. I guess that happened in our head or something? New video game called Super Ultra Sprout Mole Eater Revenge of the Moles 3. Rated M for Mature, huh? That's too violent for Hero. You definitely won't appreciate something like this. Some colorful CDs. Maybe you could play them at the jukebox. This CDs look pretty cool, but I think Hero appreciates something more sentimental. Let's keep looking. Bunch of small figurines. I've always been fond of these little guys. Hero would get mad at me for spending too much for spending my lunch money on them, though. Let's not remind him of that. Talk full of comics. Looking through these comics bring us so many memories. It's just like old times, huh, Sonny? Hero is never too interested in comics, though. Across different worlds, nothing you haven't seen. Captain Space Boy Space Adventure costs one dollar to play. Hey Sonny, let's get Hero's gift first. We can play later. Old video game console hooked up to a TV. I already have this console, Sonny, and I don't think I can afford two. Three dollars a try. Kel, how have you been, buddy? It's been a while since you come around, hasn't it? Um, what can we get him? Chock full of comics. Uh, maybe over here? So all candies. 
If we get these, I don't think they'll ever make it a hero. Brand new game consoles just look so shiny. It's like, this thing is way too expensive, Sunny. I love hero and all, but not that much. Bunch of small figurines. This, yes, this is perfect. Papa Chips, chip off the old block cookbook. Well, that's a mouthful. Hero had a copy of this when we were kids, but our dog Hector destroyed it. He's gonna be so happy when he sees this. But before, our dog, is he your brother? But before that, we need to ask the most important question. How much does it cost? $20, this is an extortion. Shoot, I'll have my wallet at home. Er, can you spot me, Sonny? I'll pay you back, I promise. Thanks, friend, I knew I could count on you. He took Hero's gift off the shelf. Hey, shopkeep, you'd like to buy this cookbook, please. Kel, how have you been, buddy? It's been a while since you've come around, hasn't it? Ah, that's Papa Chip's chip off the old block cookbook. I see you have good taste. Yeah, my brother used to follow his recipes all the time. His cookies were my favorite. It's rare to see another fan of Papa Chip's work. That'll be $20, please. Thank you, kind series. Please enjoy. You got Hero's gift. Thanks a lot, Sonny. I bet Hero will love this. Uh, I only have 13 bucks. Let's not waste our money. Alright, what now, dude? So, where do you want to go now, Sonny? Guess there's really not much to do around the suburbs, huh? How about the faraway park? Yeah, the park! We passed by it on the way here. That sounds fun, doesn't it? Alright, back to the park, huh? Alright, sure. happening up here wait don't go please sorry dude I can't help you you're on your own uh oh there's some commotion going on over there let's check it out this ain't none of my business if you got beef with her then go talk to her yourself you creep oh maybe uh is Aubrey their younger sister then I'm begging you just ask her if it's bad she won't listen to me wait is that that's Basil! <gasps> Leave him alone, you bully! Huh? Who's there? Oh, it's just Cal. Grumble, grumble. Why don't you mind your own business? Why don't you go bother someone else, Kim? Psst, why aren't you acting all high and mighty? You don't make the rules around here. What's going on over there? Is that Aubrey? <laughs> Oh, yep, that's her. Oh, hey, Aubrey. This nerd Cal just showed up and thinks he can boss me around. Let's show him what's what. Cal, what do you want? Stop messing with Basil. How could you? We used to all be friends, don't you remember? Tell her, Sonny. Sonny's here. She uh, doesn't look too happy. Wow, it really is you. It's been a while, but you haven't changed a bit. How long has it been since you left your house? Three years? Maybe four? It must have been nice to live in your own little bubble. Watch it, Aubrey. You don't know what he's been through. Hmm. <laughs> Whatever. Aubrey, please, listen to me. Hey! What's your issue? Hey, stop that! Leave it alone, Kel. This isn't your problem. What the heck is wrong with you, Aubrey? Ugh, Sonny, come on, we gotta do something. Heh <laughs> Are you guys really picking a fight? Sure, why not? The two of you against me, how does that sound? Come at me! I'll take on the both of you! Oh. Alright, so we're fighting. Is, is that a knife? Oh, I didn't... Oh shoot, Aubrey, are you okay? You're, you're hurt. I'm fine. No, you're not. You're bleeding. Come on, we gotta get you out of here. Ugh, I'll get you back for this.
Oh. You had your knife on you, dude? That was a good thing you had your knife there. We would have... Wait a sec! Give me that! You shouldn't be carrying things around like this, Sonny. That's dangerous. Harvey's really changed since you last saw her. Her and her new friends been nothing but trouble. Poor Basil. Let's check if he's okay. Hey, Basil. How are you doing? Oh, I'm fine. Thank you, Kel. I don't know if you noticed, but Sonny is here, too. Say hi, Sonny. Oh, hey, Sonny. It's been a while, hasn't it? Haha. <laughs> Woohoo! What a happy reunion! So, did you want to hang out with us today? Oh, I'm sorry. I'd love to, but I, I should probably head home. Really? Are you sure? My, um, my grandma hasn't been feeling too well lately. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Let us at least walk you home. It's been so long since we all hung out. Oh, alright then. Thank you. Alright. Uh, I wasn't aware that, uh, Sonny had his knife on him. So, is he, like, delusional? It's a street that's diagonal from ours on the crosswalk, so it's this way. Oh. Because we're seeing all this stuff that it's in our dreams. Uh, oh, oh, this must be his house of all the flowers. It's that one for the green roof. Man, uh... <laughs> I... Wow. Uh, there's probably a way to beat her without using the knife, if that's the case. There, uh, so using the knife on her probably is gonna, that's uh, probably gonna come back to bite me in the ass later. Okay, how long have I been recording for? Alright, let's see. Uh, I think it's been about like 30 minutes. We'll keep going. This, this could be an extra long episode. Wait, please don't go! Ah, uh, I mean... I'm so sorry. I actually have a favor to ask. Hey, Basil. Anything, Basil. What do you need? Well, you see, something important was taken from me. When we used to be friends. Do you remember how I used to take pictures of everyone? Of course I remember. Those photos meant everything to you. Ah, uh, right. Well, Aubrey, she took my photo album and- Aubrey stole your photo album?! Well, she- she won't give it back. What a scumbag! Don't you worry about a thing, Basil. Me and Sunny got you covered. Ah, okay. Thank you. By the way, about what you said before. We're still friends. I want you to know that, okay? Okay. Well, I'll see you later. Come on, Sunny. There's no time to lose. We got a photo album to find. Let's check Far Away Park for clues. Alright. We're like, playing a completely different game now. Hmm? Someone's in this tree? Oh, I guess we can't interact with it. No, oh, it looks like Aubrey isn't here. Oh, I know. Your name's Charlie, right? I see you hanging around Aubrey sometimes. Do you know where she is? You know, Charlie, I can tell you're not really the mean type of person. Aubrey took something important from Basil and we need to get it back. Is there any way you can help us? <laughs> Who? What? Where? Now, where'd you do that for? Ah, if it isn't killing that weird knife guy, we're the adversaries for the great and mighty Angel. Finally, it's time for you to meet your doom, Angel. We don't have time for this. We just want to find Aubrey. Do you know where she is? You seek Aubrey, do you? Interesting! I'll tell you what I know, but first, you must best me in battle. But battle, but I don't want to punch a kid. You won't be able to lay a finger on me. Come on, let's sick him, Charlie! Huh, are we doing this? Uh, 
Well, we don't have our knife on us anymore, so... <laughs> and running is not an option, okay. Let's encourage. Jeez. We're really just punching a kick. You surprised me, Kel. You'd make a worthy rival for my master. Charlie is standing there. He does take 25 damage. Alright. Sniff, you, you'll pay for this. Alright, this beat my training was all for nothing. Ow, my head hurts. You're the one who started it. You bully! Uh, okay, Angel, so I'm be serious now. We beat you and Charlie, so tell us our obvious. Hmm, a promise is a promise, I suppose. I'll honor my word and tell you what I know. The truth is, Aubrey is somewhere in faraway town, probably. Dig it, Angel! You better not be messing around or else. I told you I'd tell what I know, and the truth is, I don't know anything! Angel, you better tell us where she is now, or else I'll tell everyone by the time you wet your bed at summer camp. Huh, well, you can't do that, it's cheating! Anyway, I really don't know. Maybe you can ask my master, the Maverick. He's the keeper of all knowledge. He told me that himself. The Maverick? Oh no, you mean that weird kid, Michael? Don't you dare call him by that name! He would take great offense to that. I see, so it is him. Where can I find Mike? Uh, I mean the Maverick. I'll tell you what I know, but you'll have to fight me first. Or I can tell everyone about the time. Like, ah! Okay, fine, I'll talk. Master went to the fountain at the faraway plaza. He said he was going to meet some girls there for a date or something. Ugh, disgusting. Come on, Sonny, let's go to the faraway plaza. I think we're done here. Uh, let's give this little lady some trash. What's this? Is this money? Oh, cool. And then I told him, it's not Maverick, it's THE Maverick! Oh, the Maverick, you're so funny! Oh, wow, what an amazing story, the Maverick! Girls, girls, please, there's enough of me to go around. Michael, what are you doing? Ah! If it isn't Kel, my heart's nemesis! Finally here to admit defeat, are you? I don't have time for this, Michael. We're looking for Aubrey. Have you seen her around? Stop calling me that. I cast away that name a long time ago. Michael, do you know where she is or not? Again with that godforsaken name. <laughs> How dare you make a... <clears throat> oh my god. I gotta stop doing these deep voices. This shit is murdering my throat. <clears throat> I, the Marriott, will not stand for this. Alright. This is probably a boss fight, and my throat is kind of killing me right now, so I think I'm going to go ahead and end the episode off there. If you made it this far into the video, thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you are enjoying the series so far, please be sure to share your support by liking the video and subscribing if you haven't already. And if you are already subscribed, please make sure to hit the notification, uh, to turn notifications on, uh, so that you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. And uh, with all that being said, I hope you all have yourselves a good one.